spent all year putting them suits together. All year spent thousands of dollars on them feathers. Like, imported different type of material to make those suits, you know what I'm saying? So that be some exclusive shit. That's not no shit you can just go in the store and buy. That's like tailor-made. Every piece is like Pacific, you know what I'm saying? Look, check this flow. Look at these Indian flows, man. Look at that shit. Them feathers, man, that shit probably come from India somewhere, man. That ain't no shit you can find anywhere. You know what I'm saying? Word. That's Yeah, really? bro, I know they put the white pole leaf there, they put the black pole leaf there. Yeah, Racism yeah. Mardi Gras, but it's pop. Napoleon, the Jackson, and black Mardi Gras from Jackson to Canal Street. <laughs> Same thing, hustle and flow, grind, grind, grind. Like, he got the artist that he knew he could create a movement with. Them two, Cash Money and No Limit, changed American music. Straight out the 504. And that's the real. So, you know, it could happen again, but it's gonna look different because music has changed. The way people, you know, get music, the way people listen to music, all of that has changed. So it's important for people to understand the changes, but know that we are a very unique breed of people here in New Orleans. And people love what we do around the world. People love New Orleans music. People love New Orleans food. People love New Orleans culture. Use it. Make big records. Don't make corner records. Make music that you think could affect the world, but keep your New Orleans. 504 to the Me <laughs> Show, man. Where you feel all this could feel balanced at? Cause sometimes I be feeling like you have like eight diamonds in the city, right? And sometimes these eight diamonds won't click up when other when other fans want to see them make music together. But the thing is, they they have a little inner beats with each other. Nigga, we New Orleans. You ain't never saw Baby Master P on no fucking song together, man. <laughs> what the fuck? Let's All these do. niggas don't blend like other niggas. We hold grudges deep. Nigga hold deep grudges. You don't know if like family tired, nigga, whack the nigga parents. We so close here, nigga might have done that nigga family something. Nigga ain't friends with that shit. Right. Nigga ain't cool with that shit. That should be different. The street should run deep here, man. Nigga might have stabbed nigga in jail and burned nigga up in jail and come so you gonna rap when we frank we rap. Bitch, I wish I would get around your ass, but I'm gonna let your ass have it. <laughs> yeah, that's all, cause you know, I'm just trying to find, you know what I mean, balance. Cause you know, I be, be, cool I be, I be, I be, I be trying. It'll be cool if everybody can be balanced and culture, but everybody ain't, but I'm cool, with, I'm cool with a lot of different people, so I ain't gonna say like that. I could transcend a lot of different hoods and areas, cause I'm cool with a lot of different people, I know how to be cool with a lot of different people, but I know the people that be wanting to be, nigga want to be cool with everybody, but they're gonna go bad. And if they go bad, it'll be like, it's going, I don't see nigga reconciling here. This ain't no reconciliation city. So don't come here and fuck over nobody cause nigga hold that girl deep and fuck over a nigga. You ain't lying, dog, cause I, I, I be like that on the same token, but you know, when I, every time I come to New Orleans, right, Skip, you know, a lot of artists, they like to get with me, and they be asking me questions like, man, how you get out of New Orleans? Cause you know, you a camera, I be like, I'm not an artist, I watch a lot of artists. But you your know character, I mean? Jim, you, your, your character transcends, Jim. You a friendly person, you know how to trans talk to different people, you know how to blend. You know how to maneuver like a committee, you can blend in, but everybody in New Orleans niggas stand for what they stand for. Nigga come from the hood, and them hoods and still them niggas, that's his beliefs, and that's how his league live. Yeah. And you can't change no hood. That, I don't know, it might be like the Crip of the Blood thing, yeah. but there's more hood handlers like that. That's really how he hood rock, and that's how they do. Niggas standing on that bit for real, for real. Right. I'm glad you giving me this game because, you know, like I said, I'm just trying to take it and, and try to make some positive out of it. You know what I'm saying? I've been trying to hope for the positive, but we're different, like, but Katrina when a lot of us got out in New Orleans. Yeah. Them other cities understood when a uh, different new, we a different kind of people. Yeah. We'll come fuck y'all we shit grab, up. Yeah, we were grabbing the pill, we were popping. Yeah, we, but then if we love you, we love you. If right. we love you, we love hard. Right. That's why I probably love hard. That's the nigga problem, and niggas love hard. 
And if you break that love, nigga hate harder. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> Hey, go me and Skip find the balance, nigga. Hate harder, right there. Right you find the balance. Yeah. Nigga hate all, my nigga. You already know we got motherfucking Jay Jones, damn it. Then we got motherfucking uh, I got Young Jew. Yeah. Oh man, I got Young Soldier. Oh, we got BG Son, T.Y. Uh, all of them killing this shit, man. Yeah. They killing, they killing this shit, man. So guaranteed. Oh man, thank you, Skip, man. I appreciate you for talking with me. You know what I'm saying? That's what I needed right Jump, there. Jump anytime, man, because we had chicken and watermelon. Yeah. 3400 South Claiborne. And now we downtown. 1700 Frank. Chicken and watermelon all day. Best shit you ever gonna have. You gonna see us. We gonna be coming to a city near you. Catch us in the drive through I need a guy like yourself, bro, that got that demeanor that grew up in, in the heart of this uptown shit, you know what I mean? When when it was really fucked up, like, you know, the 92 era, you know what I mean? So you went through that and you made it out there and, you know, I feel like your OG stand with me. So right. I feel like, you know, when I speak to you Definitely. and Skip and, you know, right. these guys, you know what I mean? That, that, that put in, they're putting in the time and, really, you know, just, just saw it all, you know what I mean? Right, and right. I feel like I, I needed to talk to y'all for y'all to give the young guys the understanding because, you know, these were the guys that was watching y'all coming up. Right, right. I mean, you know, and we had others that we watched, and like I said, I jumped off the post like 95, right? And um, I just seen a lot of shit play out, and I'm at the age right now, and I'm pretty much sure, you know, niggas that's in their 30s, you know, early 30s, coming out of their 20s, they're probably at this point in their life. Um... <clears throat> You know I can fuck over you. You know how I'm coming. You know the kind of niggas that I ride with. Hold on a second. Come on, come on, you got it. My bad. No, you but uh, you know the kind of uh, uh, niggas I run with. You know what section of the city I'm from. So me telling you I fuck over you don't even make no sense. Cause if you check my background, you know what it is. But I much rather not. Because we not winning that way. We're not getting no way. You know, nowhere that way. My dick bigger than yours type shit. You know, this this music shit is 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 like a home. I'm gonna give you this and I'm gonna let it go. Uh, this arm you have is a, this is a severe cut and they put a tourniquet on it, right? To stop the bleeding so you don't bleed to death. Now there's a possibility that you could lose this arm. Or if you catch it fast enough, you'll be able to save the arm. So you gotta look at it like this. This tourniquet is the media. You, Jambalaya, Godfather, Hip Hop Itinerary, all social media platforms. This is the trinity, right? The cut is the beef that niggas go through. The arm is the niggas. Now as long as <laughs> social media and the media can constantly put a bad look on it, they control this. They control the flow. If we don't give it no attention, then it'll die. It's like anything else. And that's the only way down here that will make it. Because if it's beef shit, then it shouldn't be televised anyway. The news gonna do it for us when the work get done. And that be and, and, and that be the fucked up part, you know what I'm saying? Cause like that that's the losing. So me telling you, I'm not gonna be a product of that. I already I already been a product of that. I done seen niggas come, I done seen niggas go. Some of my best friend, closest family members. Come on, man, you know the song, it's the same old song. They gotta come a point a point in our lives as blacks and especially from New Orleans <clears throat> that we gotta change the narrative. We just gotta change it. Bitch, don't nobody fuck with us. And that's stamp. Everybody know everybody know how New Orleans come. You feel me? Atlanta no. Florida no. Texas no. Nigga when Katrina dropped nigga <laughs> like scattered roaches, nigga, you seen how we was coming. So with that being said, we don't even have to worry about throwing our dick around. Let's just click up, get this motherfucking bag, and shit on everybody. On the real. Big facts. Man, thank you, Tonto, man, for, you know what I mean, talking to me, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, all day, this, But I need the clarity. But I done been part of the stupid shit, too. Right. Into the fire sometimes, right. you know what I mean? Right. But I learned to have to help. Other artists and other other people help their families, man. Cause you know I'm able to help mine. You know because I mean? you control their future because you show them in the light, either in the negative or positive. And it's up to you as the cameraman to when a nigga get on that dumb shit, be like, okay, 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 my nigga, look, okay. You know? All right. All right. What else we got? 
right. because once you control and all these film guys start controlling the content and choosing what you choose to be a part of, then that's when the narrative will change. 